<laughs> Hi, catch up class one. It was a swing out kind of a week. We started off looking at circles first off, didn't we? So we went one, two, come, dunk them all on the spot and bring your back. So my chair, my five, six is quite big on the spot. Mine comes around again, so I stay close. So I feel like you're swinging around me, so it's uh, one, one, two, three, three four, 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 five, four, five, five. So we built that into a swing out, we started with the basic, we went one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, I'm just going to do a circle but let go, three, four, five, six, seven, and then that's in the heel piece. And then we did this nice inside turn variation, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and that was it. That last move um, has got a, a one, two, three, and four. Oh no, it doesn't feel like it does. One, two, three, and four, that's what it does. And then I'm going to look at my invisible wristwatch, take my turn on the one, one, five, one, uh, on five, six, seven, eight. So really, I'm just doing the same movement and repeating as I did before with the other three moves of circle and the invisible swing out. For me, it changes slightly on the five. One, two, three, and four. Five, I feel much more like I'm travelling straight forward, no turn this time, and I'm going to step through. Really, the only direction I can turn to finish is that way, otherwise I'll end up. So, all the way through. One, two, 